They say one in every five blacks in the world is a Nigerian. No wonder there are a lot of Nigerians in different global positions. In this video, we'll take a look at 10 British actors of Nigerian descent. At number 10 is Kamen Ejogo. Kamen Elizabeth Ejogo, born on the 22nd of October 1973, is a British television and film actress and singer. She began her career as host of Saturday Disney Morning Show from 1993 to 1995. Her film credits include Love's Labor's Lost, 2000, Was the Worst That Could Happen, 2001, Away We Go, 2009, Sparkle, 2012, Alex Cross, 2012. The Purge Anarchy 2014, It Comes at Night 2017, Alien Covenant 2017, and so many more. Ejogo was born on 22nd of October 1973 in Kensington, London, England. She is the daughter of a Scottish mother, Elizabeth Nee Douglas, and a Nigerian father, Charles Ejogo. She attended the Overtree Roman Catholic Primary School and Glendower Preparatory School and was then educated at Godolphin and Latimer School. Ejogo was briefly married to trip-hop artist Tricky. In 2000, she married American actor Jeffrey Wright, whom she met while making the HBO film Boycott. They have a son, Elijah, and a daughter, Juno. Ejogo and Wright have since divorced. At number 9 is Richard Ayoade. Richard L.F. Ayoade, born on the 23rd of May 1977, is an English comedian, actor, writer, filmmaker, author, and television presenter. He is best known for his role as the socially awkward IT technician Maurice Moss in Channel 4 sitcom The IT Crowd, for which he won the 2014 BAFTA for the Best Male Comedy Performance. Ayoade appeared in the comedy shows The Mighty Bush 2004-2007 and Nathan Bali 2005 before gaining exposure and recognition for his role in the IT crowd. After directing music videos for Arctic Monkeys, Vampire Weekend, Yeah Yeah Yes and Kasabian, Ayoade wrote and directed the comedy drama film Submarine in 2010. Ayoade co-starred in the American science fiction comedy film The Watch in 2012 and his second film The Double which premiered in 2013. Ayoade was born in Hammersmith, the son of a Nigerian father and Norwegian mother. Ayoade studied at St. Joseph's College, Ipswich. He later attended St. Catherine's College, Cambridge from 1995 to 1998. Ayoade married actress Lydia Fox in 2007. They have three children and live in East Dulwich in the London Borough of Southwark, England. At number 8 is Tracy Ifeacho. Tracy Ifeacho is a British television and theatre actress best known for playing the role of Aya Al Rashid in the vampire series The Origins. Ifeacho is of Nigerian Igbo origin but born in Plymouth, Devon, England where she attended Plymouth College Preparatory School and Egg Buckland College for her secondary school education. Ifeacho attended the Relay School of Speech and Drama under the tutorship of Norma Blake. After completing her A-levels, Ifeacho used her gap year to audition for London Drama Schools and gained a scholarship to the Royal Central School of Speech and Drama in London. After graduation, Ifeacho shot her first feature film, Blooded. Ifacha then went on to make her theatre debut as Minerva in the Royal Shakespeare Company's production of Knots and Crosses, directed and adapted by Dominic Cook. It was from here she made her television debut as Leila in No Going Back. Ifacha was offered the role of Abigail Nen Smith in David Tennant's final two Doctor Who episode, The End of Time, Part 1 and 2. Ifacha has appeared in other productions like A Rising in the Sun. In 2016, Ifacho was casted in the ABC thriller series Quantico in the reoccurring role of Lydia Hall. At number 7 is Nonso Anozier. Nonso Anozier, born on the 17th of November 1978, is a British actor who has worked on stage, film, and television. He is best known for his role as Tank in Rock and Roll, Sergeant Dab in Ender's Game, 
Abraham Kenyatta in Zoo, Captain of the Guards in Cinderella, and Sarah's son Daxos in the HBO television series Game of Thrones. Anozi was born in London, England, of Igbo Nigerian descent. He graduated from the Central School of Speech and Drama in 2002, and in the summer of the year, he played the title role in William Shakespeare's King Lear and won the Ian Charleston's Award in 2004 for his performance in Othello. In 2011, he played Atos, a Zamoran pirate and close friend of Conan in Conan the Barbarian. That year, he was also cast to play the role of Saro Saldasos in the HBO series Game of Thrones. He also plays the role of Samson in the History Channel's television miniseries The Bible. And from 2013 to 2014, he played the role of Rainfield on the NBC series Dracula. In 2019, Anozier portrayed the antagonist Kago in the prime video film Guava Island, starring Donald Glover and Rihanna. At number 6 is Hakim K. Kazim. Hakim K. Kazim is a British Nigerian actor who was born on the 1st of October 1962. He is best known for his work in the television series Black Sails and his portrayal of George Rutaganda in the 2004 drama film Hotel Rwanda. K. Kazim was born in Lagos, Nigeria, where he spent his early years before his family relocated to London, England. His interest in acting began with school plays and the National Youth Theatre, which is where he discovered that he had a love for acting. He trained at the Bristol Old Vic Theatre School, graduating in 1987, and was offered a space with the Royal Shakespeare Company, where he continued his classical training. After working alongside Brian Cox and Ian McKellen for the Royal National Theatre, K. Kazim made a successful transition into British television, appearing in the Bio, Trial and Retribution, and multiple episodes of popular BBC series Grand Hill. He then moved to South Africa, where he became well known for film and television roles. However, it was his role as Georges Rutaganda in the Oscar-nominated film Hotel Rwanda, which brought him international attention. Following the success of Hotel Rwanda, K. Kazim relocated to Los Angeles. He went on to appear in Slipstream and The Front Line before starring in Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End as Captain Jokard. He followed it with a role in the blockbuster X-Men Origins Wolverine. Called The Man with a Beautiful Voice, K. Kazim has also done extensive voiceover work ranging from television and radio to video games. At number 5 is John Boyega. John Adedayo Adeboyega, known professionally as John Boyega, is an English actor known for playing theme in the Star Wars sequel trilogy films. The Force Awakens 2015, The Last Jedi 2017, and The Rise of Skywalker in 2019. Boyega rose to prominence in his native United Kingdom for his role as Moses in the 2011 science fiction comedy film Attack the Block. Boyega's other credits include Detroit 2017, Pacific Rim Uprising 2018, four episodes of the television series 24, Live Another Day and the 2014 drama Imperial Dreams. Boyega received the BAFTA Rising Star Award in 2016. Boyega was born on the 17th of March 1992 in Peckham, London, England, to British Nigerian parents. His mother, Abigail Ni Aboderi, worked with the disabled and his father, Samson Adek Boyega, was a Pentecostal minister. Boyega was a pupil of Oliver Goldsmith Primary School. Boyega's father, a preacher, had wanted Boyega to become a preacher too, but was supportive of his son's theme interests. In 2003, Boyega started his secondary education at Westminster City School, where he took part in various school productions. Between 2008 and 2010, he attended South Thames College at the college's Wordsworth campus to study for a national diploma in performing arts. He enrolled at the University of Greenwich to study Bachelor of Arts Film Studies and Media Writing, but dropped out to focus on acting. In March 2012, Boyega was cast in the film adaptation of Chimamanda Ngozi Adichie's book, Half of a Yellow Sun. In January 2016, Boyega formed his own production company, 
Upper Room Entertainment Limited. In the 2020 power list, Boyega was listed in the top 100 of the most influential people in the UK from African African Caribbean descent. At number 4 is David Oyelowo. Born on the 1st of April 1976, David Oyetukumbo Oyelowo is an English American actor and producer. His highest profile role to date was as Martin Luther King Jr. in the 2014 biographical drama film Selma. In 2016, he also took the lead role in a United Kingdom, as well as playing the role of a chess coach in Queen of Cartway in 2016. He has played supporting roles in films like Rise of the Planet of Apes 2011, Lincoln 2012, Jack Reacher 2012, and Lois Gaines in The Butler 2013. Oye Lowo was born in England to Nigerian parents. His father is from Oyo State, while his mother is from Edo State. He grew up in Tutimbe while enrolled in theatre studies at City and Islington College. His teacher suggested that he become an actor. Oyelowo enrolled for a year in an acting foundation course at the London Academy of Music and Dramatic Art and finished his three-year training in 1998. He played Joseph of Arimathea in The Passion. In 2014, Oyelowo formed his own independent production company, Yoruba Saxon Production, which has co-produced movies that featured him including Nightingale, Captive, Five Nines in May, and most recently, a United Kingdom. In 2015, he was selected to portray James Bond in Trigger Mortis. Oyelowo was appointed Officer of the Order of the British Empire OBE in the 2006 New Year Honours for Services to Drama. Oyelowo and his wife, actress Jessica Oyelowo, became naturalized US citizens on the 20th of July 2016. They have four children and now lives in Los Angeles, California. At number 3 is Sophie Okonedo. Sophie, born on the 11th of August 1968, is a British film theatre and television actress. She began her film career in the 1991 drama Young Soul Rebels before appearing in Ace Ventura When Nature Calls in 1995 and Stephen Frizz's Dirty Pretty Things in 2002. Okonedo was born the daughter of Joanne Ni Alman, a Jewish pilot teacher, and Henry Okonedo, a British Nigerian who worked for the government. Okonedo was raised in her mother's Jewish faith. When she was five years old, her father left the family, and she was brought up in near poverty by her single mother. Okonedo trained at the Royal Academy of Dramatic Art. Okonedo's breakthrough performance came in 2004 when she co-starred in the film Hotel Rwanda, playing the role of Tatiana Ruse Sabagina, the wife of Rwandan hotel manager and humanitarian Paul Ruse Sabagina, which was portrayed by American actor Don Chidori. For this role, she became the second black female Briton to receive a nomination for the Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress at the 77 Academy Awards in 2005. She later received a Golden Globe Award nomination for the miniseries Tsunami, The Aftermath in 2006, and BAFTA TV Award nominations for drama series Criminal Justice in 2009, and the television film Mrs. Mandela in 2010. Okonedo was appointed the commander of the Order of the British Empire CBE in the 2009 New Year Honour, and an officer of the Order of the British Empire OBE in the 2010 Birthday Honours. At number 2 is Adewale Akinoyi Agbajaye. Born on the 22nd of August 1967, Adewale Akinoye Agbaje is a British actor, director, and former fashion model known for his roles as Simon Adebisi in Ozi, Nekwana Wombosi in The Born Identity, Cross in Thor The Dark World, Killer Croc in Suicide Squad, Mr. Echo on Lost, Malko in the fifth season of Game of Thrones, and Dave Dawson in the NFL biopic drama Concussion. Akinoye Agbaje's directorial debut, Famine, wrapped production in 2017 and had its world premiere at the 2018 Toronto International Film Festival. 
Akinoye Agbaje was born in Inslington, London, to Nigerian parents of Yoruba origin who were students in the UK. When he was six weeks old, his biological parents gave him up to a white working class family in Tiburi, Essex. His foster parents had at least 10 African children, including Akinoye Agbaje's two sisters living in their house at certain points. As a young boy facing a cultural identity crisis, he joined a local skinhead gang in order to escape racial persecution. At 16 years old, having become a thief, his foster parents sent him to a boarding school in Surrey where he ultimately attempted suicide before coming to terms with his background and turning his life around. He went on to earn a law degree from King's College London and a Master's in Law from the University of London International Programme. While in the university, Akinoye Agbaje worked in a clothes shop where he was introduced to the world of modeling. Akinoye Agbaje's modeling career led him to Hollywood, where he began his acting career with a 1995 role in the film Congo. He would go on to appear in so many world-class movies. At number one is Chiwetel Ejiofor. Chiwetel Ejiofor is a British actor born on the 10th of July 1977. He enrolled at the National Youth Theatre in 1995 and also attended the London Academy of Music and Dramatic Art. Ejiofor made his film debut in the television film Deadly Voyage in 1996. Ejiofor was born in London's Forest Gate to upper-middle-class Nigerian parents of Igbo descent. His father, Arinze, was a doctor and his mother, Obia Julu, was a pharmacist. His younger sister was CNN correspondent, Zane Asha. Ejiofor began acting in school plays at his junior high school, Dulwich Prep London. He continued acting at his senior school, Dulwich College and joined the National Youth Theatre. He got into the London Academy of Music and Dramatic Art, but left after his first year after being casted in Steven Spielberg's film Amistad in 1997. Ijeofor has played more classic characters like Okwe in Dirty Pretty Things in 2002, Lola in Kinky Boots in 2005, The Operative in Serenity in 2005. Solomon Northup in 12 Years a Slave in 2013, Vincent Capu in The Martians in 2015, Carl Modo in Doctor Strange in 2016, Dr. Watson in Sherlock Gnomes in 2018, and Triwell Kamkwamba in The Boy Who Harnessed the Wind in 2019. Ejiofor has received numerous awards and nominations for acting, including the BAFTA Orange Rising Star Award in 2006 two Global Globe Award nominations and the Lawrence Olivia Award for Best Actor for his performance in Othello in 2008. In 2008, he was appointed Officer of the Order of the British Empire by Queen Elizabeth II for services to the arts. He was elevated to Commander of the Order of the British Empire in the 2015 Birthday Honours. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe before leaving.